Okay, so I hope that you have enjoyed the part one and part two. So this is the part three in which I will be showing you how to create uh, an automated uh, data entry form in Excel. Okay, to do that, the first one is we need to create the columns first. Okay, say for example, uh, I want to create uh, a data entry form for employees, their names, their, their date of birth, their social security numbers, their basic salary and other remuneration tax and after tax income okay so first one is id okay the name of the employee then assn of the employee date of birth of the employee okay and then uh, basic salary okay then i want to create say I'm making the font uh, the bigger okay then other pay okay so total pay okay then tax um, okay so after tax pay this is it so then uh, the, in the second step, you select this one and go to data and filter all the columns. Okay, and we know that total pay is equal to what? Total pay is equal to basic pay plus other pay, right? So this is and tax equal to total pay multiplied by tax rate. Say, for example, flat flat tax rate is. 30 percent 0 0.3 okay and after tax would be equal to the total pay minus tax this is after tax okay so now uh, we will be working on this say uh, so then after creating all of this go to the file then go to option option okay so you are here and go to the quick access the quick access toolbar so here you can see that popular commons these are the popular commons okay so click over here then commands not in the ribbon commands not in the ribbon okay so we need to select a form so form here is the form okay add this one okay now you can see that there is a form over here. Okay, let's click on this now. The same one. Uh, selected range. So we need to select range. Say uh, other pay. Mm. Okay. So let's clear it. You can see that. Okay. Now I'm closing this one. I want to select all. Okay. So we have all. Okay. So you can see that ID. Say for example ID. Then second one name is uh, John. The SSN is one to one, and date of birth seven five uh, two thousand. Okay. Then basic salary. Say basic salary is hundred thousand, and other pay is twenty thousand. Okay. So click new. You can see that the other entries have been automatically created okay so now what we can do sorry do select this again uh, the new one okay so now again id number two say gene name ssn 225 the date of birth Five seven nineteen eighty. Okay, then basic salary say two hundred thousand and other pay is ten thousand. Okay, so new entry. This is how we have seen that all this is how we create the data in a database. Okay, and for 
simplicity what you can do and for a nice look you can color it okay then this one or i am gonna do this i want to use the side border okay then again this one the side border okay so delete this one okay so this is how we create the uh, automated data entry form so you can see you select this one click for so it's done there okay so if you want to create a new entry so you just create the new one okay this is really really uh, interesting document interesting uh, function of excel so again three then uh, say clark ssm 335 uh, data part so 2 5 okay basic salary say 70,000 and other remuneration 0 okay so new okay it has been created so that's how it creates okay this is how it works okay so we can delete let's see if we delete this one okay this is how it works okay and i wanted to show something in excel new formulas but uh, i'll show you uh, in the classroom okay uh, for this online class this is uh, uh, the last one and we'll be discussing more in uh, face to face class thank you so much for being with me